is Gonzalo Lira. This video will be voiced using text to speech because I am too angry to talk today. I have been following the war in Ukraine ever since it started, and I said in my last video that I strongly support Putin and Russia. I strongly believe that the Western elites governing America, the EU, and NATO are an existential danger to humanity, and that Russia is the last realistic defense in Europe against the evil Western elites. At the start of the war in Ukraine, Gonzalo Lear has been doing great content about the war from the perspective of someone in Ukraine. However, his point of view was very favorable to Russia and very anti the Ukrainian government and anti Zelensky, so he has become popular in Russia and among pro Putin people in the West like myself. However, the result of his anti Zelensky content was that he became unpopular in Ukraine and there was at least one assassination attempt on him by the government or supporters of Ukraine. This caused Gonzalo Lira to have to hide underground. However, something very concerning has been happening with him. Gonzalo Lira has stopped posting content on YouTube, Twitter, and the other social media sites that he uses, and has been missing for multiple days. At this point there is a good chance that Gonzalo Lira has been killed by the Ukrainian government or by supporters of Ukraine. I have been a fan of Gonzalo Lira as a YouTuber for many years now long before the current war happened. I very much hope that he is still alive and safe, but I have a bad feeling that something bad happened to him. We don't know what happened to him yet, but there is a good chance that the worst has happened. At this point I have absolute contempt for anyone claiming that the Ukrainian side is fighting for freedom and democracy. The Ukrainian side is not fighting for freedom at all, they are fighting for globalism and liberalism and they don't care about the freedom of people who speak out against them. I ask that people share Gonzalo Leary's videos around as much as possible, and that we keep his memory alive as much as possible. Thank you.